Hey, I'm Daniel Thomas, safety for the Jacksonville Jaguars. And this is my throwback reel, and I'm here with ESQ. Oh my gosh, 10th grade. That's crazy. That was my first game ever starting in 6-8. I was like 5, 6, 150 pounds, I believe. <laughs> and we played against my one of my college teammates named Cameron Petway. He got a star running back at Auburn. And uh, I think he played for the Vikings for a little minute. Got a chance to go against him. And everybody had a lot of hype on him because he was committed to Florida State. And he flipped and went to Auburn. And I had like three or four tackles on Cameron Petway. I mean, I mean, I felt like I did pretty good, you know, playing my first career game on the same the screen. Oh, shit. Junior year. Should have caught the pick. Good hit, DT. Good play. Probably should have been a pick, interception, but good pass breakup. I had like, so like eight or 10 tackles or something like that. I think I had like, Pass breakups, tackle for loss. Good game though, we lost though. <laughs> we lost a good game though. Oh, so yeah, I'm coming. So let's go with the slide. We're playing Jefferson Davis in high school. Uh, the pump return, I think it took you like 50 yards, it was like 50, 60 yards, something like that. It was like a momentous shift in the, in the game. Game was tight. Jeff and Davis was on the field. I was like 4 0, we was 2 and 2. Came in, and I think after that pump return, that shift the momentum of the game. Jeff and Davis in high school again. It was a good game, but not really. We lost, and I should have went down. After that pick, I fumbled the ball. Played against Cobb and Mac Young and Marlin. Had a big hit. Saw this play in the prize. Good play. Another pick. No, this pass break up. It's Jefferson Davis. I should have caught a pick. Yeah, we played against Mac and Marley. You know, Mac and Marley played on the same team in high school. But when, when this game, they beat the Perks off of us. <laughs> they embarrassed us. But when Marlin played at Greenville, we beat them every year we played them in the spring game. I think after this game, they was like, hey, man. This kid probably got some moves. Put me a pump return next year. And I caught a pick. Like it. That's a hit. That's a pick. This enterprise again. Yeah, like four picks my junior year. Get shot on the sideline. Caught another pick this Jeff and Davis. Same game. This is great old field tackle. I borrowed that. He ended up signing to West Virginia, I think. Score a touchdown right here. I just had a fun recovery since you've been in the city. Got off in the school. <laughs> Definitely went fast enough. Different angles, same game, same play.
don't know why I put his on there. Yeah. I can say like my junior, that's not a truly like kind of starting to find my game, you know, like, you know, as a player, like you you know what to, what to do. But once you like know your game, you know, kind of like to switch stuff up and, you know, play more finesse, play with more swag, more confidence. So I think my junior year, that's when I start like to have more confidence in myself and make more plays. After my junior year, I got my first offer from Troy. I like went through the whole spring, you know, schools were coming in. Different schools sending me letters, interest letters, but like it wasn't offering me no scholarships. Honestly, high school was harder than college. I don't care what nobody say. Like, I coaches, like, I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, some days, bro, I ain't, I used to be like, is this even legal what they used to do to us? <laughs> like, I talk to my coaches all the time, bro. Like, that's how close I am to my coaches. Like, I just believe it ain't no, no, no uh, shortcuts in life. And our coaches, they really put us through it. Like, DBs was the last to leave off the field every day. We would get on the field probably like three some, almost like three some. We would leave like seven to eight o'clock at night. Playoff game against Kansas City. They cheated us. We should have won. This when we played Matt down, caught a pick, see the game. Slide. It was, it was probably the best game of my high school career. I had like two picks, pick six. I should have cut the in and out because I fell over myself. <laughs> fell over myself. Caught another pick, since we said again. That boy right there, he was like six six. Name Jamal Couch. She signed up Mississippi State. Pretty good. Another interception. My senior, I had, I had let, like, I had let the state in interceptions. So like, that's kind of like the turnaround for me and my recruiting. Like, that kind of like sparked a lot of stuff up. Like my senior, I had a good, a good year. Enterprise, last home game, firm recovery, couple tackles. And I scored off a great field goal. We Tonka, this is this we Tonka game we won. I got a fumble in the game. Everybody's throwing the field. Can't really see this one, but I know I stripped the ball out. Forced fumble. We recovered it. They ain't even want to give it to us. Wrestling, you want to give it to us? That's crazy. I'm gonna cheat so hard, bro. Force fumble. Dog Trishon took it in for a score. Pump turn. I went to the uh, special team coach and I told him he put me in pump turn. <laughs> they ain't want to do it in college. I don't know why. I miss wearing them from the ring a lot. <laughs> no, no. 80 yards. Mm. First game of the season, 90 yard pump turn, touchdown. Senior year, that was my best year. Let stay the interceptions, pump turn yardages. You know, I was always running the ball, like, a, like second on the team in tackles. My senior year, we went off, like made a run for playoffs. You know what I'm saying? Won the city, the area championship. You know what I'm saying? Like we had a, a lot of scouts come through the school. You know, I signed like the biggest scholarship since like Antoine Caldwell. He played at Alabama. But 
You know, I thank God for, you know, everything for real, but like, like from my ninth grade year, 10th grade year, 11th, 12th grade year, like I got better each year. You know what I'm saying? Kind of like went through that whole process. My senior, that's when I really, you know, knew what I was doing. The game pretty much slowed down to me. And like, I, I knew where I was supposed to be. I knew how to go make plays. Here from Auburn, I was here from Alabama. Plans are off for me. Louisville off for me. South Carolina, North Carolina, Georgia Tech, Mississippi State, Minnesota, Maryland. During the year at the time, that's probably it. Besides the mid-major office, so I had like Middle Tennessee, Southern Miss, Georgia Southern, Troy, teams like that. I mean, it was close to home, but I, I always wanted to play in NCC. I, you know, like once I got started getting recruited, I really didn't care no more. So, I mean, I wanted to stay close to home. You know what I'm saying? It was kind of like, you know, spoke over my life, you know. Carbon is probably one of the best decisions in my life, honestly. It ain't nothing like the Arvin family, honestly. Like, if y'all ain't ever been to Tiger Walk, then you can't, you ain't gonna be able to experience what I'm talking about. The Tiger Walk is probably the best tradition in college football. You know, you get a chance to walk down, and you, they, you drop, the bus drops you off in the middle of fans. Like, you walk down from the, the complex all the way down to the stadium and like, there's fans everywhere, you know, you walking down, you know what I'm saying? Everybody's showing you love, you know what I'm saying? They greet you and they know your name, they know you by face, you know, it's it's kind of cool, honestly. Yeah, so. Just playing in Jordan here, like, I, like, any SEC game, like, I'm sold out. Like, I know you go to other teams, like, they ain't winning, they fans not coming. Like, our fans came when we were You know, like, hard work definitely pays off. But like, you know, you gotta have faith and, you can't have faith without the work. Once again, I'm Daniel Thomas, uh, Jacksonville Jaguar Safety, and I uh, just want to thank y'all for watching. Y'all also can follow me at Daniel underscore underscore DT21 on Instagram or Game Changer 021 on Twitter. So, like I said, thanks for watching.